Still being treated in that ambulance, you know that a car ride from Pahrump does take a lot longer than a helicopter ride would. A lot of those answers will come back, obviously, with the autopsy right. results. Now to Sunrise Hospital, where Denise Rosh has been watching the situation unfold throughout the day. And Denise, well-wishers who have seen Lamar Odom at the hospital are all saying he is in very bad shape. Yeah, Jim and Jessica, according to the Reverend Jesse Jackson, he was unconscious when he was there for his hospital visit earlier, but hospital staff is remaining, is remaining mum on this one, refusing to even update Odom's condition for us. Meanwhile, we asked a local fertility doctor, it might be legal, but what is herbal Viagra? There's no federal regulation. Dr. Paul Wilkes has been helping local families with infertility issues and high-risk pregnancies for 13 years. And over-the-counter remedies such as herbal Viagra, he says, can be dangerous. And you're essentially playing Russian roulette with your health. You're taking a medication, um, a pill, a supplement, and you just have no idea what you're ingesting. According to Dennis Hoff of the Love Ranch brothel, Lamar Odom had been at the business drinking alcohol and taking herbal Viagra before he was found unresponsive in his room Tuesday afternoon. Today, well-wishers stood outside Sunrise Hospital waiting for word on his condition. All I can say is we'll keep him in our prayers. And one of Odom's first visitors, the Reverend Jesse Jackson, telling us Odom is in a private room, unconscious but surrounded by loved ones. We fall down, we get back up again. We fall way down, we have to climb a much steeper hill. He has a steep hill to climb. He's been pulled up by so much love and care. Now, as for herbal Viagra, doctors tell us it can be especially dangerous for men taking some very common blood pressure medications, even leading to stroke or heart attack, even death in some situations. They tell me no matter who you are, no matter what your health, you need to check with the doctor before taking any kind of supplement. Reporting live, I'm Denise Rush for News 3. Let's go back to you in the studio. All right, Denise, thank you for the update from the hospital. News 3.